Good morning guys and welcome back to the Sullivan family. It's 2024 guys, 2024. And what a start to 2024. Happy New Year to all of you. Everybody that supports us, everybody out there that sends us amazing comments. You guys that genuinely support us, you know, you're part of our family. We really appreciate how much we've grown in 2023. And we're so looking forward to what 2024 brings with you guys helping us along the way as well. So here we go, eh? Here we go. But I just thought I'd start New Year's Day with this because the sun is just coming up. The sun is just coming up and it is as still as you like and it's absolutely stunning. So there we go. Happy New Year, guys. So what have we got planned today? Well. Anybody that's followed us for a while, you will know that our, our New Year's Day tradition is always to get the decorations down. It's one of those things we've always done. It's just, um, it resets the year for us. We take the decorations down and that, that's us then saying, hello 2024, let's get right on with it. Let's start making the videos. Let's get on with it. Let's, let's really see where we can go this year, you know. And, this, and today is the day that it starts. So we are really, really excited to see where 2024 takes us. We are gonna do, like we said in last night's vlog, we're gonna do as many videos as we possibly can. If we could do a video every day, we'll do a video every day. Um, the only thing that will get, get in our way is unforeseen stuff. Wi-Fi going down, medical problems, whatever. They're the only things that will stop us, but we'll give it a, a good shot. So here we go, guys. Should we get on with the day? Okay, so everybody is dressed, aren't they, Florence? Is everybody dressed? Is everyone dressed? Yes. <laughs> Everyone's dressed. I'm just finishing my coffee a minute. It's about 10 o'clock in the morning. I'm just finishing my coffee. Uh, and just wait for Zoe a minute until um, Mission de Deconstruct Christmas starts. <laughs> Got to take all the lights down today, haven't we? Yeah? Got to take the Christmas decorations down. You're going to help Mummy inside. You're going to help Daddy outside. Yeah. Do you want to help Daddy outside? Yeah. Yeah. Do you go out in the garden and do some lights? Right. Yeah. Do you want to help me? Yeah. Take your dummy out for a sec. Boop. We, do you want to help Daddy with some lights? <laughs> Where did you get that from? Where did you just get that? She had a secret dummy. She's got my five. No way. She totally got me there. That's funny. I was just saying, we're deconstructing Christmas today, aren't we? <laughs> go so quick, doesn't it? It's a Christmas tree. Does that mean your gonk friend's going to have to go away? Yeah, he is, I'm afraid. Oh, no. Till next year. Kit off. Till next year. So everybody's dressed, aren't they, now? I'm just going to, I'm going to drink my coffee before we start. Oh, I'm drinking my coffee. So we're having a very, we're having a, Zoe and I had a discussion this morning, we're having a very chilled Christmas, uh, New Year's Day, but we, we also have chilled New Year's Eves, having had quite a few hectic ones when we were younger. But um, I, think, I think now the kids are starting to get older, but there's a difference between celebrating New Year, like, like we used to. People drinking, we don't, obviously we don't drink, so... That's kind of not the main no. aim for us, but it would be nice to spend it. So I'd like to see the fireworks somewhere. Yes, definitely. Sometime. We were talking about it. We've seen everyone's reels and, and stuff like that from, from New Year's Eve. Yeah, yeah jump down, darling. Jump down, jump down. Had fireworks. Whoop. There you go. To celebrate it properly with the family kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, it'd be great, wouldn't it? One year. So who knows? Maybe next year we'll try and do that, shall we? I mean, I was in bed for midnight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm totally honest. I think we all were. We did. We ended up playing. Uh, so what did we play in the end? The logo game. The logo game. Least, oh my goodness. It's the game with the least arguments because, like, uh, we're not we're not saying they're like bad arguments. No, do you know what I mean? But they're family, family squabbles. Family it's so family funny. Board games. No, like what games like Monopoly can be like. Yeah. I mean, everybody's got to know that. Everybody's probably got a family story surrounding Monopoly. A board game. At least, but the logo game. Trivial Pursuit we're normally alright with. The logo game. But because there's so many of it, it just takes such a long time. Yeah. It's so it's funny. Because it's just all the snacks. Bought, we had a tub of chocolates, which went in about five minutes. All the crisps, everything got eaten. We did get 
I mean, we're two and a half hours and we still haven't finished the game. So no. we kind of had to just we had to, we had to call it. Um, call it, call it quits. Because people needed showers and bed and stuff like that. But, um, <laughs> it was great fun. Yeah, it was good fun. It, it fun. causes the least arguments in mm -hmm. the game. It's actually a really fun game. It's actually a lot harder than you think. You think, oh, it's just logos, that's going to be easy. No. It's actually a lot harder than you think. It's a lot more into it than that. It's a really good game. But it, it's Yeah, the logo game, there you go, it's really good. Games nights are always good fun. It is. They normally have a story to tell afterwards. <laughs> It's normally always somebody with a stupid answer. I think it was me last night. So what was it? What's what <laughs> seabird? What seabird or, or whatever the questions around about seabirds? What is the Asda's alternative to a penguin bar? Yeah, but it, it's, it was a seabird. Yeah. What was the answer? Is that? I said seal bar. <laughs> seal. <laughs> because I was thinking that's what they're called, but that's not. That's the Aldi alternative, and I missed the seabird bit. It was a puffin. I didn't even know that. I had no idea that Asda did a, a bar called a puffin bar. The girls did really well because they go shopping, don't they? So they go shopping with you. Everyone did quite well, actually. They did. I didn't uh, win. No, I did. I came second. My team came second. It was me and Toby. Me and Eva. Me and Eva won. Right, we're going to finish these coffees and get on with um, taking the taking Christmas down. Yep. Okay, we're going to drink our coffees, guys. It's quite nice outside this morning. Got my band of little helpers. Toby's upstairs, he's a bit tired. He had a bit of a late one last night, about half past nine he went to bed. So he's upstairs at the moment. So just a reminder then, I'm gonna be taking down lights on the windows, lights on the fence, lights on the bush and the door. And then I've got a plan in my head for next year already. So what I really want, I've been seeing Daddy. people with these, um, they're Daddy, like, yes, the conquer. conquer? Yeah. Blimey. That's cool. <laughs> it's got a conquer. Are these, uh, they're like, they're supposed to represent Christmas trees, aren't they? So they're like a pole with the strings of lights coming off the pole and going into the ground. So that when the, when the lights are switched on, they look like a Christmas tree. I want one of those for next year. And I want it to be at least, at least, yes. Okay. Awesome. I want it to be at least, at least, at least 10 foot, 15 foot. I want it to be quite high. Do you know what I mean? So then we'd have it in this whole area here. We'd have a big, like, Christmas tree with the stringy lights coming down. And I think it'd look awesome. So that's my addition for next year, for next Christmas. So I can't wait for that. Because obviously we love Christmas in this house. What are you found now? Right, too many conkers going on here. It's too many conkers. I'm gonna crack on with the lights. Why I should ever let you go? Mm. I don't wanna wake up if I'm dreaming because you know I can't get enough of this feeling you're giving me. Don't wanna wake up. No, I don't wanna wake up. I don't wanna wake up without you. Baby without really sunny it is look at that it's like really sunny right we are starting in here with the tree so they're all outside or some of them are outside taking the outside lights down we're making a start with the tree and then we've got the winter wonderland to take down we've got candy Lane lane to take down candy Lane. and then we've got <clears throat> some christmas trees in some bedrooms the girls has already gone because of the big whole water disaster um and the boys has gone because toby wanted to put his lego out so we've just got the little one's tree and the tree in the older girl's room upstairs and then there's some bits and pieces around the house that i'm sure we'll find we're going to have a bit of a clean as we go obviously um so yeah not full clean because it's new year's day i'm not doing all that 
but <clears throat> a little bit. It is January. Yeah, it's January the 1st, New Year's Day. Oh. Um, so Agnes doesn't want to go outside. Uh, so she's going to stay in and help us with the tree in here. So we're going to make it start. Wish you could see the things I see. I don't want to wake up if I'm dreaming because you know I can't get enough of this feeling you're giving me. Don't want to wake up. I don't want to wake up. Don't want to wake up without you, baby, without you. Phase one is complete. The bush lights are down. On to phase two, the window lights. Phase two is the window lights. Are we ready to do the window lights? Yeah. Okay. Erin, are your arms okay? Uh, Leah? Yeah. Leah was being, she was being my light holder. She, she did a really good job. Right. Window lights, phase two. What you wanna do? I think we're part of something bigger, and now my mind is filled with you. Oh, you know, 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 baby, with us. The tree is down. I wish it was as quick as it looked in that time lapse. But we put a thousand lights on the tree, so it took us a bit. But the tree is down, the space is cleaned. I've dusted the TV like 20 times, but because the sun's shining in, it's still looks smeary and dusty, so I'm just leaving it now. Um, so we're gonna do the window next. Um, we're kind of just in a lot of boxes. There's a lot yep. of boxes kicking around. Um, we actually haven't got all the boxes here, somewhere over in the storage units, so we need to go and get them. Um, but yeah, next, next thing is the window over there, so that's what we're on to now. Okay, Leah, that's phase two complete. Window lights are done. We're doing a good job here, me and Leah. Everybody else has gone inside. Everybody else is too cold, they've gone inside. Um, right, phase three next. What's phase three? The fence lights. Should we get on with it? Yeah. Let's do it. Right, phase three is complete. Well done, Leah. Well done, Joseph. Joseph came out and helped as well. Well done. Okay, so we've had a bit of a rethink. The lights that we put up in the back for Christmas, 
the girls want to leave some of them right so we're going to leave the lights around this bit because obviously we've got ideas for summer now and the, we've got ideas of how we're going to dress this up in the summer this area here our little loungy bit and we're also going to leave these lights on so you'll have lights around the what we've now turned into a bike store and you'll have lights around that bit there sorry if i'm making everyone dizzy that bit there so that's the plan so the only ones i need to take take down now are the window lights which actually look like christmas lights don't they so they're, they're going to come down so that's the consensus so this is phase four phase four we're doing phase four now this is the last phase the window lights That's us done now with the Christmas lights. So we've got all the Christmas lights that we need to get down, down. So that's all done, isn't it, Leah? So Leah has been fantastic help this morning. So thank you very much. Well done, darling. I really appreciate it. Um, I'm going to go back in now. Should we go back in and see what mummy's doing? Yeah. We're going to go back in and see what mummy's doing now. Okay, windows done, cleaned, put back dusted. together, TV's dusty again, even though we just dusted it. Um, I have got some other bits and pieces to go in the window, but for now, yes, we've still got pictures to go up. I'll just say like that for now, it's clean, clean and tidy. Um, for now. For now. So we've done that, the tree is down, we've still got, that's still my... Candles. Mm -hmm. um, we've still got... The candy cane lane to come down we've still got the stuff in the dining room to come down and some other bits and pieces but um we're stopping for lunch now we have made good progress so far but we're stopping for lunch we've got a bit more to do Okay, so as you can see, we've had lunch. Florence really needed a nap. She was very grisly this morning. She really, really needed a sleep. So I just said to Zoe, right, if you and the girls carry on doing a bit of Christmas decorations, I'll bring the little ones out for a, a quick blast in the park. In fact, I haven't been to this park for ages. So it's quite nice to just come down and uh, let them have run around for half, uh, half an hour and let that little monkey have a sleep. 
because she needed a nap. So after this, I'm going to go back and then everybody's going to join me down on the coastal path. Just, just literally just down from our house because I want to get some uh, news day photos. So that's the plan for a minute. I'm just going to enjoy a coffee for half an hour. <laughs> Let them have a play. Right, we've done lunch. Um, we are now on to the stairs, as you can see. The last stairs. Um, as well as done the other ones. Next is this. So we're going to take this down next. Ben's done all the lights outside. The lounge is kind of, I think it's mostly done. Um, dining room still needs doing. Bits around the house. Oh, the Christmas tree's up in their rooms as well. Um, I've got one down. And yeah, so this, this, this is next. Right, Candy Cane Lane is no more. I know that sign's not staying there, it's staying there. It's, I'm gonna get Ben to move the um, nail up a little bit. Um, so yes, it will be staying there, but it's not in that position. Isabella's just trying to clean some of the marks off the wall um, from the chicken wire, but it looks very bare. Now, my stairs look bare. Apart from all the junk on them that is not supposed to be there. Um, my doorway looks bare. Anyway, um, next is the dining room. Ben's taken all the cards down. Um, so it's just the window, the garland's gone. It's the window and I think that's it. There's a couple of bits hanging around maybe. So yeah, I'm gonna drink my coffee and then we're gonna do this. <laughs> right guys we are mustering the troops we've just come back from the park we're mustering the troops now as you can see they're all getting ready want to get these photos did you have a nice time in the park yeah. it's good fun wasn't it yes let's go to that park more often
I've got my pictures. Put your hands up, give me my It's done. Is it done? Window is clear. Dining room is clear. Well, apart from all the other stuff. Um, batteries have taken out of everything. We've been out for a quick walk at the back because the weather's been lovely. We wanted to get some, some photos and the sun was just going down. So we've been out for a quick walk. Now it's dark. Now I'm on to doing tea. That's the day gone. We do have to pop over to the storage unit later to get some um, of the boxes to bring back because we've kind, of, we've kind of packed away most of the Christmas stuff now. Everything's down, I think, um, and most of it's put away, but we need to go and get the Christmas tree box and some other stuff. And then when all that's sorted, it will be done. To be fair, we left the advent calendar up last year until July. So um, there's always something that you miss, always. Hopefully we haven't missed anything this year, but everything's looking very bare now. It's all looking a bit bare, but still. Um, had a bit of a clean round, so uh, that's good. Not totally, obviously, but had a bit of a clean. Um, yeah, no. Hello. <laughs> I'm gonna go and cook tea now. Um, oh yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Tip, yes, tip so. for um, when you're putting stuff away, especially like things with batteries, take the batteries out because too many times have we put things away, left the batteries in them, and then when you get them out the next year. The batteries of like um the, the acid starts to leak out of them and it's all gone horrible and you end up having to chuck stuff out um and plus you don't want battery acid over everything because it's minging and dangerous so yeah take the batteries out before you put things away and it will um they'll last longer you know what i mean anyway i'm off to cook some tea Oh my goodness! It's got skittles going on. It's going all over on the side. Everyone's air up bottles and Starbucks cups and all the rest of the paraphernalia. Yes, Christmas decorations are ninety-nine point nine percent done. Are they not? Are we yeah. pretty much done? Everything just looks bare. It does, but it's always the same, isn't it, after Christmas? You have the Christmas build-up, which is fantastic. Then you have Christmas week, which flies. New Year's Eve, New Year's Day, and then we pack it all away, don't we? And look forward to it again next year. Uh, but we've had a fantastic Christmas and a great New Year as well, doing what we do, haven't we? It's just gone too fast. <laughs> it's gone well too, way too fast. Too fast. Like every year, goes too fast. It does. But we are done, guys. We've got exactly what we wanted to get done today done. Uh, we even managed to get out to get a nice photo. And I took the kiddies out to the playground as well, to the play park. They had a little bit of fun over there, didn't they? The waves were massive today. The, the oh, weather, it's, it's really weird because the weather is really weather. calm. It's not windy, it's not stormy, but the waves were huge, yeah, weren't they? Yeah, some good sets coming in. Some good sets. Really good, really impressive. I love filming it. Do you know what? I love filming just that bit of coastline. Literally just over there. It's, it's great, isn't it? It really is. It's just a nice place to go for a walk and just go chill out, take some photos and stuff, so. Anyway, guys, that's it for New Year's Day, 20, New Year's Day 2024. So we are now heading straight into 2024, aren't we? I've just realised that our calendar is still 2023. 23, I know. I haven't changed the dates on the calendar yet. We better do, because we've probably got stuff to put on it. We'll do it tomorrow. No, I won't do it tomorrow. I'll have to do it. No, we're not doing it tomorrow, because we are going toy shopping tomorrow. So the children have all got Christmas money given by aunties, uncles and whatnot. <laughs> So what we've said is we're going to take them over to Smith's Toys in Inverness tomorrow and make a day of it. Now, we've tried to push ourselves before and do too much, no. but we are literally just going to go to Smith's, Smith's Toys. Toys. It's the only thing. We'll and we end, up, we end up spending about two hours there anyway, don't we? So it's going to be a toy shopping day tomorrow. There is a Starbucks right next to Smith's Toys as well. Oh, yeah. handy. I forgot about that. Although it does have the smallest car park ever. But anyway. Um, <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. It'll be fine. I'm hoping it won't be too busy. <clears throat> it's... Tuesday. Yeah. Hopefully it'll be all right. I'm sure it'll be fine. Most people are back at work, aren't they? Kids, um, the kids definitely want to go and spend their Christmas money. So we said we'd take them over. That's a bit of a treat. Never, there might be some sales on. Maybe. Maybe. So that's. Agnes has already got a list of things that she wants. Yeah, but her list adds up to about a grand. So yeah, you <laughs> she'll be getting a, she'll be getting one or two things off her list. She wants a squishmallow, another one, and she wants some Lego. 
so it's not too bad. Not too bad. Anyway, guys, we're going to get the kids to bed. Uh, that's it from us. We hope you've had a fantastic New Year's Day as well. That just leaves us to say, we're looking forward to tomorrow's video. Just leaves us to say, leaves us to say, please subscribe to our channel. Oh, I had a brain blank then, brain blank. Please subscribe to our channel. Please hit the bell for notifications, drop us a like. Don't forget our link tree in the video description below for all of our social media, our Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. And that just leaves us both to say, thanks for your support, guys. Here's to 2024. Take care, and we'll see you in tomorrow's vlog.